Hello Huns and welcome back to our haul. We have not done one in a while, especially not a winter like autumnal one and you know, it's my favourite season. I felt like it was time. This video is a collaboration with Princess Polly. You know how I feel about Princess Polly. I feel like it's just me personified, like everything on their website is Sadie Bass, Sadie Bass Slay. It is, it gets my seal of approval. So very excited to be working with them. I do have a discount code, obviously. It is Love Sadie gets you 20% off, which actually is a hefty amount. So yeah, you can thank me later. If you're new here, my name is Sadie and yeah, my life's a bit of a mess, but I look cute whilst doing it. And that's pretty much, yeah, my mantra. Who's enjoying my setup? Some of you are probably thinking, wow, wow, how, when did she get so professional? I haven't, it's just because I'm in between moving. So my room, it's a, little, it's a little bit cray cray up there so we had to move the rail down to the living room for this i haven't shopped on princess polly before one why not huns because it is in the uk now i know i always used to look at it on like all the australian baddies and influencers and be like mm, i wish they did shipping to the uk and now it's in the uk you can get free express shipping on orders over 40 pounds that's within two to four days so perfect and they also offer afterpay to all uk customers 20 percent vat is payable at the checkout so there's no like sneaky surprise costs they do 30 day returns which i think is pretty good because some brands they'd be doing it for like 12 or 14 days like i haven't my brain doesn't work that quick i haven't comprehended that i want to send something back in that time and they also add over 150 stars each week so it's always you know keep refreshing the page because they have some bang and bits in it at the moment which i'll show you but i bet if i went on it today i'd be like oh my god i want that i want that i want that and finally it is shipping from the us so now we've got all the little housekeeping bits out of the way let's get on to the clothes if you're new here i'd absolutely love if you could subscribe i do two videos a week when Wednesdays and Sundays and of course let me know down below like your fave bits or any opinions we like to have healthy debates on this channel <gasps> let's go I wanted to keep in with a lot of autumn trends I wanted to see if Princess Polly is wearable for midsize I wear a size 10 to 12 in a lot of UK brands so you can see how it looks on my body you know work out if it's right for you so the first <laughs> <laughs> the first trend I got, I've been intrigued to try, was a bolero. Mm. Don't know if you know what a bolero is. It's kind of giving like ballet energy. This is the Moran Eco Nylon Two Piece Bolero Top Sage, and I got this in a ten, which is a US six for any of my US or Australian hands watching. It feels incredible. It's bolero is basically where you get something that covers your arms and like a little cardigan vibe, but this feels oh, so soft. Love the color sage. It comes with a bandeau and the little bolero and I'm just gonna pop it on with this skirt. I have been looking for a perfect black skirt for so long and we have this. This is the Selby mini skirt. This is also from their eco range and I got this one in a 12 and a, U a UK 12, a US 8. So I thought I'll pair these together and see how it looks. This is exactly how I thought it would look. It feels like buttery soft on the skin. It is so gorgeous i always love the color sage on so many skin tones and look it's not like see-through or anything on the nipple like i don't really like wearing bras with these kind of tops because it ruins it it's giving me like ballet classy chic i love also in the winter i do like to ditch fake tan a little bit and opt for a lighter glow or completely get rid of it and i feel like this color is still going to be really flattering on me and what's so nice obviously you can take it off and just have the bandeau like if you get hot or if you want to wear the bandeau with another top you could even wear this over like a black or white one to mix it up but i love that it looks like a top and then the skirt it fits me so nicely if anything i would say it's like a tad big but then you know it's gonna be christmas your girl loves roast potatoes i'm probably gonna fill it out my weight fluctuates i don't know about you my weight fluctuates all the time like in the same month i could be like a 10 12 it's crazy so i don't mind there being a bit of room because at least it covers my bum which is the most important thing because a lot of black skirts like for some reason they're so short but this one i love the length of it it's just a classic black mini which i think is pretty much essential in every girl's wardrobe because it goes with everything you can wear jumpers you can wear tights biker boots it just it really does the most and this will probably be out there i think my most worn piece because it is so simple but yeah i really think this is these go well together really really cute definitely happy with the first thing i picked up okay next i think this was my thing i'm most excited to come from the whole haul 
how god i didn't realize it was gonna come with the like collar already on i thought i was gonna have to put a shirt so i think that is just 10 out of 10 this is the sunny knit crop cream and i got this in a uk 10 us 6 i love it i don't wear loads of neutrals but i think for autumn they go with everything and I definitely want to get better at wearing basics and things that can be styled together than statement pieces. I want my, my things to last, you know. I saw so many girls on Pinterest wearing this with like a, a nude skirt or like cargos or jeans or preppy. It's just feels thick as hell as well so yeah i'm gonna pop that on just with the skirt i'm wearing now please um make sure you undo the buttons of the collar before you put it on because otherwise you look like some sort of maiden mother mary nurse situation going on but it's nearly on just give me a minute i don't want to get makeup on it no because i'm actually in love it is the perfect amount of oversized i've got a thing with oversized that just makes you feel cool no stop because this is literally everything i needed and more i love oversized things like i know i'm petite but i love an oversized sleeve i don't know what it is it just makes me feel like cool girl energy it's a really really lovely shade of cream as well very very flattering it's a thick knit like it is very crop but i kind of feel like it's keeping you warm while being a bit cheeky and it shows the smallest part of your waist which is always going to be super flattering as we know i probably wouldn't wear it with the black skirt i'd wear it with like something nude on the bottom like that's dreamy that is dreamy <laughs> no stop i actually know i'm in love no i'm in love oh princess polly you've done it again the shirt is literally attached like to the sleeves and underneath which i think makes it a lot more stylish and put together kind of giving like gossip girl off to going to harvard like i feel like this is what the stylish girls that study like laura harvard wear do you know what i mean not that that's ever gonna be in my vicinity but yeah i love this what do we think what do we think just wait a minute wait a minute i've had a brilliant brainwave i got the most unreal pair of preppy shoes you're gonna die you're gonna die are you ready are you ready these are called the penny lane loafer in the high shine and this cleat this cleated sole is almost like sexual to me like that is my love language that is gorgeous because i have a pair of like rogue loafer things from last year but because they don't have the cleats they look a bit like low-key school shoe vibes whereas this this is now you're speaking now we're talking i'm thinking you know, do you see my vision? These are this outfit. Peng, peng babes. I've never said the word peng in like 12 years, but I'm saying it because that's how I feel. And it doesn't stop there because obviously I'm a styling queen. I'm a fash hun. I also picked up these little socks called the Every Woman Socks Cream. And I'm hoping that they match this jumper perfectly. Oh my God, they're so cute. Oh my God, they feel lovely. Look, they're like little lace with the frills. So we're gonna pop them on with the loafers. I swear, do not, don't look at my toes. Don't look at my toes because honestly, do you know when you paint your toes a color and regret it? That's what I have right now. They're really ugly. They're like chocolate brown. I thought it would be aesthetic, like Hailey Bieber vibes. I can tell you now it was not. Ooh, oh, they're so cute. This is like genuinely the kind of thing I used to wear in school and I'm so happy it came back. Okay, let's get the shoes on. So I didn't know that US sizes are like different shoe sizes so i'm a seven in us it fits a uk five. Oh my god they add whoa i am tall like i'm not even in the camera frame these are cute damn sadie back at it with the brogues how cute these are so aesthetic and fashionable at the moment and you know what it's a trend that's been lasting since last year because these were in fashion last year and i feel i feel like they will be for a long time which is good they're obviously like kind of like prada dupes without the hefty price tag which we love i probably would roll these down a little bit more i've seen people wearing them with like leg warmers you can wear black socks you could just have them tucked into tights but it definitely gives that preppy energy of course it's great that it gives you height because i'm five three so now i'm probably like five five she's actually a model now <laughs> let me know what you think of the loafer trend girls right i have seen these jackets everywhere and i wanted to get my hands on them for the longest time finally i've got my opportunity and i feel like this is going to be my jacket like my jacket of the autumn like the winter like, i ain't taking this off ta-da goldsmith pu bomber jacket in black they also had brown it was out of stock when i looked but it could be back in stock and i think the brown is equally as cute but black does just you know go with literally everything so this is really nice oversized so i got a 10 because i thought i'm quite sure i don't want it too long oversized it's got a little collar a zip like it's just this 
edgy rocky girl vibe so yeah i can't wait to get this on that is the perfect size for me i am so glad i did not get a 12 because i really wanted it to fit just where my skirt goes because i think that's kind of sexy i don't know about you like big jacket with your legs out maybe tights biker boots or like me get your little loafers on and you just look like small and cute and like oh kind of like your Borrowing your boyfriend's jacket, but who needs a boyfriend when you've got a Princess Polly bomber jacket? But yeah, when she said oversized, she meant it, but that's exactly how I want it. Oh, she's just a cool girl. She's just an edgy queen. No, I, this, and it was literally perfect to go over jumpers, hoodies. Can you imagine like a hoodie dress, this, and then knee high boots? Like, you're gonna. I'm sorry, that is like a fashionable icon, but yeah, I'm really into this. Like, I feel like leather jackets, they're never gonna go out of fashion. This is super cool, really thick, really nice feeling, but it's flexible enough that, you know, you can run for the tube. You can get it on and off. Love it. Some of you might have spotted this little creature. It does actually look like a creature. I can promise you it is faux far. This is not an animal, even though it looks like, you know, like a little puppy or something. This is the Delby fluffy hat in grey. And I just was like, I really want to push the boundaries this winter and autumn and try and be a bit cool. And this, you know, I saw the model on the website. I will include a picture. She just looked sick. Like she looked like everything I want to be. And a cool, vibey girl going around London, ignoring men, you know. And also you're going to stay warm while doing it. So let's Pray and hope that this looks good on me. It is warm. It is warm. Oh my god, is it giving like mushroom? Like, do I look like a mushroom? Or do I look cool? Oh, I think I look cool. Am I cool enough to wear this? Be honest, guys. Am I cool enough to wear this? This is definitely like Princess Polly Girl. I see like this cool, fluffy bucket hat, which I feel like is gonna be a huge trend this autumn. You wanna stay warm, but you wanna still look cute, you know? I definitely feel like it goes with this outfit, like see me walking around whoa whoa who is that just a cool kitten there <laughs> this little pea head's gonna be very very warm this autumn just you watch babes oh definitely is warm i <laughs> hope i don't have hat hair now okay we we're plowing through this pretty quickly we've still got a few bits left i hope you're still with me this is just a masterpiece really stunning i love 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 the color like as you can see i've got a lot of things in this really gorgeous like slate gray grayish kind of tone because i just think it's flattering especially or for this time of year and like look like my eyeshadow i'm really into like that sort of gunmetal gray i'm thinking of getting it on my nails i just think it's a bit different a bit cool not everyday warm tones so this is the kennedy sweater in beige you know it's called a sweater but really it's like sort of fishnet-y holes and you can see your outfit underneath but I just think that is so vibey and I know there's so many ways I'm going to be able to style this. Okay, I think this might be my favourite thing. This is just me and an outfit. It's baggy, it's cool, it's different but it's, you know, still a bit sexy as you can, it's kind of see-through, you can see underneath. I think this is so flattering. I've just got it on with that bandeau. I probably would wear it with... Well, you could do black or white or this kind of, you can't really see the colour. But yeah, you could even wear like a bralette, something a bit even sexier under. It's just such a cool styling layering piece. I'm also really showing how many things you can actually wear with this skirt. Like it is, like I said, a stable piece. If you only get one thing, I think definitely just get the black mini skirt. It's so comfy. I don't even feel like I'm wearing anything. Also something I feel you can dress up and down, which I think is always a win. Like you could wear it with something more demure and just jeans and probably wear it if you have quite a casual workplace or you could literally wear it with like a, oh, can you imagine with a slinky black dress underneath and like platformy knee-high boots i'm actually going to an event tonight so i might style it up like sexy for the event i think i'm gonna go as far as to say yeah 100 this is my fave thing it's just chef's kiss next we have a trend i've also wanted to try for a very long time but haven't found the right pair and that is parachute pants i feel like it's a very marmite thing like people either love them or hate them i really want to see if they'll suit me because they look sick on so many girls and it's just very cool there's a lot of ways to style them princess polly have loads of different colors these are the austin parachute pants in gray like i said i'm really into like silvery grungy grays and yeah they just look and feel like this they feel really good quality i got these in a uk 12 us 8 and yeah, um, let's just get these on. I'm just gonna pop them on under this and hopefully we have like a all gray moment. Maybe that could be cool, maybe not. I'll be honest, they're not really a vibe with this, so I'm just gonna whack this off. Baby tries, parachute pants, let's go. 
Do I look cool like those girls on Instagram and Pinterest? I think so. Do you know what? You can actually do a lot to adjust them. So I think they're actually meant to be worn low-waisted, but at this point in my life and my belly pooch, I don't know if I want to wear stuff low-waisted. Like, should we try it? Should we just try it for banter? I think that's how the cool kids wear them, like with their belly out, but your girl doesn't have abs of steel. She has a little pooch and that is fine. We love the little pooch, but what's more flattering for me is if we're gonna bring it up. But I appreciate the cool girlies that can do that. I probably could have got a 10, you know, just because they are oversized. I actually wish I did size down. So just bear that in mind if you are someone who wants to wear them high-waisted like me. Yeah, that is more like it, girls. I feel like with chunky trainers, this could definitely be a mood. And then crop top, little bomber jacket, crop jacket. It's just, yeah, it is just cool, like vibey, like, I'm actually really into them, more than I thought I was going to be. And also the cuffs, you can't really see. The cuffs, you can also adjust. So if you want them flared out, you can. Or if you want them to go in, which I do because I'm short. If I have them flared, it basically will drag on the floor. But I can adjust it to be right to my foot. So I'm enjoying it. I really like the sort of parachute-y vibes. I thought I'd rather wear it with like a black top, it'd look cooler, a bit more edgy, but this is just to show you. What do we think? Are we into parachute pants or not? Let me know in the comments down below. <laughs> Finally, the brow is looking very fair. We have our last piece, which is the Elena strapless mini dress. And I know what you're thinking. You're thinking Sadie, autumn, where, where? Um, I think to me, this is giving more like night out, London bars. This with big chunky biker boots, that leather jacket, you will, ca you will catch me in that every weekend. And I definitely need things that aren't super, super dressy, but are still like cool, you know? And this looks comfy, cute, and I am all about a print clash and these colors. I don't know what it is about a print clash. It just, I'm just like, oh, it just gives me the chaotic energy that I feel like I embody. And yeah, it feels really nice material. It's got a mesh overlay, little core setting, leopard print. Look, I can already tell this is gonna be banging. I got this in a 10, let's get it off. Now, I don't say this lightly, but genuinely, this is my ultimate, ultimate, ultimate dream dress. This is bloody gorgeous. I can't, it's everything I thought it was gonna be and more. I definitely feel like I could have wore, I can wear a strapless bra with this just to give me a little bit more cleavage. I don't know where my boobs have gone. I said this in another thing. I haven't lost any weight, but the boobage isn't boobing. So I'll come up close if it has actual like corset boning, but it's very comfy strapless. This pattern, I think it's just super flattering. These colors on me, like the leopard print with the little flowers, really gorgeous on fair skin, but also can imagine it on like darker skin tones too. And like I said, rock it up, edge it up with the boots, with a jacket. And I feel like, yeah, this is so appropriate for going places like Shoreditch, Brixton, but, 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 I'm not gonna ignore the fact that this would slap in the summer too. And again, I like pieces that take me through the season. So this, imagine if I go out to see Ivy for Boy again next summer, I'll be wearing this with little strappy sandals. It's giving island energy, but it also gives London energy. So yeah, that is my TED talk on why this is the best dress that you need right now. It's not too short. I just, yeah, I think I might wear this to my event tonight actually. So make sure you follow me on Insta to go see the little pickies because I love an event nighttime edgy butt pic. So that is the haul for you, Hans. I hope you enjoyed. I definitely did. I definitely feel like I picked up some pieces that are gonna stand the test of time and take me through a good few years, seasons, whatever gonna get a lot of wear out of those don't forget to use my code if you do shop any of the pieces which is love sadie and we'll get you 20 percent off please let me know in the comments like are you vibing is there any, any like styling tips you'd give me for these pieces anything you're gonna get let me know and yeah have the best week and i'll see you very very soon